Hello everybody and welcome back to the Hidebound Convivium. Uh, I know it's been probably about a month since I've uploaded last and uh, don't have much to say for myself in my defense other than saying that uh, wedding planning is hard. Um, as some of you know, I'm getting married in December, so it's right around the corner. So, you know, it's a big crunch time right now. And I'm also uh, finishing up my second to last semester and all the you know, um, stress that's accompanying that, and then I also um, have my job. So I've been pretty busy with a lot of different things lately, but I'm trying to make more time for the for the channel, and hopefully I should have the first part of Beowulf up for you guys uh, this week for your listening pleasure. Uh, so let's go ahead and take a look at the poll then, since I just mentioned Beowulf, and we'll talk about... Uh, what won and what we're doing in what order. So as you can see, uh, Beowulf won. It got uh, seven votes, so it was the most popular pick. Uh, right behind that was selections from the Canterbury Tales, and which selections specifically, I think we're probably going to do the Knight and the Miller's Tale, uh, because they are related. Uh, next is going to be selected Native American narratives, and my anthology has a really short section on Native American narratives, so I'm just going to pick the best ones and uh, plop them on there. And then I don't know if I said this, but if things tie, I'm basically going to count them as one as like one unit. So um, these are the poll results from I from 15 days after I took the poll. So they're a little bit different, but these are the ones I'm going with uh, just because uh, that's that's when I intended to stop the poll. But uh, let's see. So we're going to be doing Beowulf, Canterbury Tales, and Native American uh, stories. And then we're going to be doing these four works in this order. So, we're going to be starting in Inferno, moving on to Purgatorio, then we're going to be reading Selected Works in Anglo-Saxon Religion, and then finally we're going to wrap this up with the Analects of Confucius. Now, I've been reading a fair amount of Basho um, lately since I got his book in, so I may sprinkle in a little bit of Basho, but that is just, uh, that's just extra reading that I wanted to do because... Uh, I'm extra special. Anyway, guys, this is just a short um, update video letting you know what's going on in the channel. I also have a essay that's in the works that is very much in the same vein as um, as my uh, essay, The Visage of the Machine. Uh, so that will be up after the election because I feel like the election will probably uh, temper some of the ways that I talk about certain things. And then... Um, uh, and then I'm also st I'm still working on my novella. It's just sort of a background detail, so I'll let you guys know any updates uh, when I when I plan to publish that. So anyway, guys, uh, thank you for tuning into this uh, short little um, this sh this short little uh, <laughs> why can't I speak this uh, um, this little update video. And uh, hopefully there will be more content for you guys coming up later on in the week. Uh, so just stay tuned, bear with me, and uh, as always, God bless from the Highbound Convivium.